Hi there. Can you roar? Can you pounce? Have you ever wanted to be fierce? Well, I'm Chantal and today I'm going to read you a story about a little mouse who wanted to be fierce. One evening, little grey mouse read a fascinating book about fierce creatures. And that night his dreams were more exciting than usual. When he woke up the next morning, he had a great idea for a great game. Today I'm going to be fierce. I will crouch like a leopard and roar like a lion. I will pounce like a wolf and swoop like an eagle. Little grey mouse practiced his pouncing skills and did his exercises to get strong and powerful. He ate all his porridge and drank all his milk. He ruffled his hair so it was big and wild. Then he put on a ferocious stare. Arr! I'm ready, roared Fierce Grey Mouse. Fierce Grey Mouse climbed up the biggest tree he could find. And there he sat, waiting, waiting for someone to pounce on. Around the corner, Millie and Pink Nosed Rabbit were looking for Little Grey Mouse. They wanted to play, but he was nowhere to be seen. Fierce Grey Mouse saw them from his branch high up in the tree. Ah! <gasps> What's that? cried Millie. Fierce Grey Mouse roared. Rawr! Millie and Pink Nosed Rabbit ran and hid behind a tree. All day long, Fierce Grey Mouse roared and pounced on everyone he saw. But after a while, no one came by anymore. They were all too scared. Fierce Grey Mouse felt lonely. Is anybody there? he cried out. But no one answered. Being fierce wasn't much fun anymore. He smoothed down his wild fur. He softened his ferocious stare. Hello, little grey mouse called out with his little grey mouse voice. Would anyone like to play? Millie and Pink Nosed Rabbit peeped out from behind the tree. Watch out, little grey mouse. There's something fierce about. And they hid behind the tree again. But that was me, squeaked little grey mouse with his little grey mouse voice. Really? asked Millie and Pink Nosed Rabbit. Yes, it was really me. Can we play again? No roaring or swooping or pouncing, they asked. I promise, said little grey mouse, just playing and having fun with friends. And that's exactly what they did. Playing and having fun with friends. Now later that evening, little grey mouse read a fascinating book about scary dinosaurs. Now <laughs> what do you think? Will little grey mouse be Little Grey Mouse tomorrow morning?